We've dedicated billions of dollars to the best agricultural technologies. We produce tons of food every year, more than enough to sustain the human population, and yet millions of people are starving. This doesn't make sense. It's probably because 40% of all food produced is wasted, totaling up to over $400 billion nationwide. Our wastage is a direct result of the food service industry. Shoppers expect perfect produce every time, no wrinkles, no bruises. Restaurants must always have enough food for dinner service, leading to tons of food being expired and wasted. As a result of this, one in six kids grow up food insecure, and our landfill produces methane 20 times worse than CO2 emission due to all that organic waste. Introducing our solution, ScrapSaver. ScrapSaver is an all-in-one website that allows restaurants and charities to save money, creates an open communication between these organizations, and reduces overall food waste. Welcome to ScrapSaver. Upon entry, people are greeted with a brief description about our website, including our inspiration and mission statement. New users have the ability to donate and contact us through our various platforms. Charities and restaurants can sign up, where they will be prompted to create an account to set up their logistics. Let's start with the restaurants. On the homepage, they can view produce that charities have requested. If they click on the produce, they can learn more about it, including who wants it and how much they're asking for. Should they choose to accept, an automated response will be sent to the charity, thus starting the exchange. They can always return back to the produce list, where they can view their conversations and also add ingredients that they want to donate, such as apples in this case. Once they fill out and upload the produce, charities will be able to see this on their available page. Speaking of which, here's a homepage for charity. It has similar features such as the ability to view chats and request specific produce. If the San Jose Food Drive wanted oranges, they could simply fill out a request form and it would appear on the restaurant's homepage. They can also request available produce, and just like before, an automated message would start the transaction. What makes ScrapSaver so special? To begin with, our website is built completely to scale and is actually most efficient with more users. This allows us to save time, since charities can communicate with many donation platforms simultaneously. Charities can also order specific ingredients, which they want to prepare and distribute. However, our main differentiator is actually our transportation system. ScrapSaver's route optimization algorithm will find restaurants or grocery stores on the way of the charity's delivery drivers. Additionally, we will employ our own drivers to transport the produce, which will primarily come from large restaurant clusters, such as the Stanford Mall or downtown San Jose. We're also exploring an untapped market, employing student volunteers filling out service hours and assigning them to individual routes from local small businesses, something which has not been done for financial reasons. These select features allow ScrapSaver to rise above the competition and thrive. Compared to the current food waste recovery options, ScrapSaver focuses on eliminating the middleman in transporting goods from the restaurant or grocery store to food banks, while being able to salvage more food waste in a shorter amount of time and in a cheaper manner. ScrapSaver helps to raise awareness about food scarcity and makes food waste more accessible to food banks in a simplistic way. Our website creates a direct connection between stores and food banks while also promoting both parties. To further our mission, we created multiple streams of revenue. We intend to utilize the California Food Waste Prevention Program in addition to other federal and local funding. Private investors are also encouraged to support us with donations of any size. As we expand ScrapSaver, we can license our intellectual property in our optimization algorithms and connection functions to both make revenue and encourage others to support us in preventing food waste. Additionally, we plan to take advantage of corporate volunteer grants, which are compensations for company employees for the time they spend volunteering as drivers to help transport food for us. Our current focus is on local restaurants and grocery stores. We chose this market to validate our proof of concept and enter an untapped market of small local businesses which charities neglect. As we gain support, we first intend to expand to clusters of stores such as downtown San Francisco and eventually into the entertainment industry such as hotels and movie theaters. Finally, we will go directly to households as they are yet another untapped source of recovering food waste. In the USA, the food service industry produces a whopping $408 billion of food waste. ScrapSaver targets millions of households and businesses, which make up over 60% of this waste. In the first three years, we plan to save $1.25 million worth of food waste from local households, restaurants, and grocery stores. It's important that we address this issue soon, as the food waste market grows by 6.6% annually. So far, we have already created the building blocks for our website, ScrapSaver.org, and gained support from local charities excited to partner with us. Currently, we are finalizing our website and we plan to start targeting large clusters of stores to maximize efficiency. After our initial expansion has proven successful, we will license our intellectual property and expand to individual homes where most of the food waste is created. A huge thank you for the team.